Hey guys, Magnus Robert here, bringing you in a video. Today, I'm going to be bringing you a video on my top 10 cops that I would like in The Simpsons Tapped Out. So, I've got a few rules for this one. I wanted to specifically look at police officers only. So, no security guards, no FBI agents, a agents or CIA or anything like that. Uh, no mall cops or anything like that. I, I specifically want to look at actual police officers in specifically America. So that's why I've, I've tried to make it as tight as possible. Next week, I'm going to be doing the other side of civil servants, which is politicians. I really think they should split up civil servants and um, have one category that's just police officers. So have, you know, Wiggum, uh, Lou, Eddie, canine officer and also Brenda the robot that we got we should have one category for them and then the other civil servants will just be po renamed politicians and um, I guess actually no because Mary, only but Mary Bailey would fall into that oh Gloria would fall into cops as well I think actually what would be better is to have a Quimby family so you have Quimby Freddie his wife his mother into one category and then have, I think civil servants is fine then, and then you can have J. Edgar Hoover, Gloria, and Judge Harm really should be in Illegal Eagles. Why the hell is she not in Legal Eagles? This is so stupid. They really f mess these categories up. But, yeah, I, I, I would like them to do something like that, like that, basically. And so next week I'll do politicians, just as a general sort of theme, and, and we'll look at people who are government, you know, a part of the government in a sort of elected status so they're they're elected government officials anyway let's get into top 10 cops number 10 we are starting off with the bomb diffusing robot something else i'd like to say is there is no costume so the marge officer the Santa's little helper officer they're not going to be added um in this list anyway because i don't want to look at costumes i want to look at uh, specifically characters so the bomb diffusing robot is of course the robot in the Simpsons movie. He works for the police in defusing bombs and that's his job. He only appears in the movie because he shoots himself at the end and dies. I actually think he was kind of cool. I actually think that maybe they could justify tasks for him, but I would be happy if, well I say him, uh, I would be happy if it was just a NPC really. Either one, I'd be happy for tasks or just an NPC. Either one would be cool, but yeah, I, I do really want to have the bomb diffuser robot in the game. It's great to have stuff from the movie, so yeah, that's uh, number 10. Number 9 is Officer Scraps. So Scraps actually appeared twice, if you consider him the same character, and I don't think so. I think they are separate, but I thought I'd just put them both on the list and combine it. So this is Sergeant Scraps, and this is Officer Scraps. So they do have a slight distinction. You could call them... If they weren't wanted to add them in the game, they could just call this one, if they wanted to add both of them, they could call this one Sergeant Scraps, and then this one just Officer Scraps. It's, it's, it's an easy fix. This was a dog from when Wigan was training as a police officer, and he is dead, and this is just one dog that's in one episode earlier on. So they are two separate dogs, but they only make one appearance each, and I didn't really think it was... I didn't really feel justified adding them any higher, but I think it would be cool to get them regardless. But I, I do think they should be NPCs. I don't think there's any justification for tasks. So, yeah. That's uh, Officer Scraps. Or The Scraps. Number eight. So, this one is like... I, I realise that these are characters that only appeared in one episode. And this is Ward and Van... Zulen? 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 Oh, whatever. Ward and Zulen. These guys are just two cops who work at the Springfield Police Department, but they're only ever seen once in one appearance, and they're named in that scene that they're in. The main reason why I actually really badly want them in the game is I think it would be really cool to have a few more cops walking around Springfield. I don't know, I just think it would, you know, branch the town out a little bit more. So I actually would really like to get these guys in the game, even though that they are just, so, you know, two randos. I, I still would really like to see them. So that's Ward and Van Zulen, and then you got Earhart and uh, Kennelly, Kennelly, Ken, Illy? yeah, Kennelly, uh, Earhart and Kennelly. I would like these guys too. Again, uh, there's not really much distinction. I just would like uh, 
more cops in the Springfield. I think it would be really cool. And then finally, Fitz and Garcia. So I think all three of these should just be a two-in-one character. So you just have you have both both cops as one character. But I actually would really like them in the game. I think they could do something interesting with maybe a police-themed update where they add all these guys in, or they could add them in. I don't know some other way. I guess it would have to be some other event. But I just think they could uh, build on these characters, you know, give us maybe a backstory with these characters. I actually really like it when the, they do that in the game, where they take a character who only, like, appeared in one episode, and they give him, like, a really interesting questline. Like, I think Huge Ass, Huge Ass, his uh, questline was pretty good, and I quite enjoyed that. So, I, I would like it if they just did the same with these dudes, you know? They don't have to do something, they don't have to do much with them, but it would just be cool to have them walking around the, walking around the town, really. Plus, when we need cops... Because there's been a few quests lately where we need to send cops on quests. We'd have more. We wouldn't just have Lou, Eddie, and Wigan. We'd have more cops to send on the thing, which would be cool. Number five is Officer Sniffy. So this is the only one of the Springfield cops' dogs that has made two appearances, and that's why he makes the number five spot on my list. Granted, his second appearance, or his first or second appearance, is pretty brief, but I think he's significant enough to deserve, deserve some praise and deserve some, to be, deserve to be added. Do I think he should have tasks? Ah, 50-50. I think it would be fine if he did, and if he didn't, I wouldn't also be that bothered. I'd be happy for him to be either, really. I think I'm not, like, strong on either side. If he had tasks, that would be cool, but I wouldn't feel too bummed out if he didn't. So that's number five, Officer Sniffy. Not really much more to say. Moving on, number four is Officer Joe. So I know I did say, like, we'll have cops, but technically he is a cop. Technically he is a American cop. The only catch is that he appears in a movie within The Simpsons. So he's a character from, like, a short silent film or a silent film. And, yeah, he just has a few... It's just, like, a little sort of, like, I guess... I guess it's kind of like a a parody of Charlie Chaplin, maybe. I'm not sure. But I thought it was kind of a funny little skit. And I saw that someone made an event with this dude once in the Discord. So I figured I'd throw him on the list. I think they could do something interesting with him for sure. So that is Officer Joe at number four. Would be cool to get him. Number three is the Sheriff. So this is the sheriff from the ep the Kill the Alligator and Run episode. So this is when the Simpsons go to Florida. I actually really like his the guest appearance for this one. I think he's a cool little character. He's a uh, interesting enough little foe, and I actually kind of like the name that he doesn't either. Like the fact he doesn't have a name. I think that kind of adds some mysteriousness to him. And I think calling him the sheriff would just be perfect. Just call him the sheriff, and we'll, we'll get him in the game. Yeah, I would really like to have him in the game i think he would be a really cool addition and a perfect way to add him was to do a florida event which i of course did a video on if you want to go have a look at that video or just add him where, wherever they could do a mini update if they wanted out of that episode but it would be really cool to get the sheriff in the game number two is laddie so laddie of course was Bart's dog for uh, replacing Santa's little helper, and at the end of the episode, Laddie joins the police force. So technically, Laddie is a police officer, only barely, but I'm counting it, and I really would love to have Laddie in the game. I think he's one of those dogs, one of the Simpsons pets that I, I, I actually really enjoyed the, uh, I really enjoyed his appearance, so it'd be great to get Laddie in the game. And then, number one, can we have that drum roll? I'm going to get shit for this. Number one is the Irish policeman. So the reason why I put the Irish policeman as number one is honestly, A, he makes more appearances than, like, he makes more appearances than any of these other characters, which I think is one plus. And B, I just think he's the perfect 4th of July character. And I'm very, like... I'm very confused of why they've not added him and the old Irishman. Like, they're just, like, such randos that appear around Springfield. Like, this dude appeared in New York as well. He appeared in New York and also appeared in in um, Springfield. So, he's sort of both a cop in both towns, I guess, or both New York. Well, both they're both cities, I guess. 
or I think Springfield is technically a town. But yeah, I think um, the Irish policeman was is kind of fun. He's a funny little minor character. He's nothing you know to go crazy about. Don't get me wrong, but I I would like him in the game quite badly. And I think out of all the police that we've shown here, I think he is definitely the one that I want the most. With Laddie coming very close in second. So yeah, that's the Irish policeman. I would like him in the game quite badly. Sue me, I know it's a silly choice, but that's what I'm going with. So anyway, thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Make sure to head over to the Discord and vote which one you want to see next. The three choices currently there are the Prince family uh, is one choice. Uh, politicians is another choice. And the other choice, which has been there for some time now, is Simpsons Family Pets. So make sure to, make sure to pick Simpsons Family Pets because you want to see this one. Come on, this is a good list, trust me. Uh, but no nibbles. We, we're, we're axing nibbles. He's not allowed on the list. But that is it for the for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Tell me your thoughts, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.